the truth is, I am who I am because of my experiences. And I say like Paul, by the grace of God, I am who I am. And who I am is in many ways the sum total of my experiences. That's what gives, I believe, our preaching um, authority and anointing, anointing that wonderful churchy word that has everything to do with being made able to do what it is that we are called to do. And if we don't have any experiences, then we're just talking, you know, lots of nice words and flowery words, and, but we don't seem to value the importance of our experiences. And oftentimes, the bad ones are the ones that are the best teaching moments. Those are the things we learn from, and we can involve ourselves in what I've come to call the ministry of identification and transparency. If a preacher really wants to connect with a group of people, then it's important to be transparent. It's important to be human. It's important to identify with the struggles that other people are having, to be vulnerable in that moment, to let people know, I'm on the ground with you. I've been where you are. I am where you are. And in reality, we're all in this together. This is, this is the authenticity that I think many times the pulpit lacks. And I think the pulpit needs that to really help people.